In this video, we're doing other basic integration, things you should have memorized as derivatives, only we're going to work backwards. In our first example, uh, we recognize the answer 1 over 2 root x as being the derivative of root x. So when we integrate 1 over 2 root x, we get root x plus c. In example 2, notice that we're missing the 2 on the bottom. Well, I could include a 2 on the bottom, which is a divide by 2. In order to not change the problem, we're going to multiply by a 2 on the outside. Now we have 2 root x plus c. In example 3, notice we have a 3 in our way. Well, we can push that out in front. And we're missing a 2 on the bottom. Well, if I want to divide by 2 on the inside, I'm going to need to multiply by 2 on the outside. So now, and we'll rewrite this so you can see it better, we have a 6 integral, 1 over 2 root x dx, which would be 6 root x plus c. In our fourth example, we recognize 1 over x as being the answer to the derivative natural log x. So when we integrate 1 over x, we have natural log, absolute value bars of x, need to put the absolute value bars, plus c. In our last example, a uh, very similar problem to number 4. Uh, we want to move the 3 out in front. So if we push the 3 out in front, now we have a 3. My pen is sticking. 3 integral. 1 over x dx. Again, that would be 3 natural log. Absolute value of x plus c.